Hello, everyone. How y'all doing this morning? Oh, good. Welcome to Sex Talk with Sharonda Parker. And I'm just going to give everyone a chance to actually log on. Let's see. Here we go. Let's see. All right. So, this morning on Sex Talk with Sharonda, we have the pleasure to sit with Dr. Bridget Stibb this morning. This is my spiritual mother. Which and I, I want to I wanna <laughs> welcome you to my show. Thank you so much. You know, I, come, I came on your show so many I times. Know, right? <laughs> so um this morning we're gonna be talking about snatching his soul. And a lot of times people say, Oh my God, what does that mean? So um when I decided to do this show, um one thing that I want women to understand is I want to be able to reach you on all levels. I want to be able to reach you on physically, spiritually, financially, emotionally. So that means even sexually, of course, because, you know, this is Sex Talk with Sharonda. But I just believe in a woman being balanced in every aspect of her life. OK, so before we get started. I just want to tell you thank you. Thank you, girl. <laughs> Look, we're a team, all right? We all are a team here. Okay, so my first question is, what exactly is the soul? Wow, that's a good one. And this revelation that God has given me, many don't have this. Mm -hmm. Because so many of us study the spirit, mm -hmm. but we don't study the soul. Mm -hmm. But you got to actually accept the question. What is the spirit without a soul? Mm. You need them both to balance mm -hmm. and you know what I'm saying and to be effective and to succeed. But here this wisdom though. The the, the the soul the soul only gonna deal with the natural. Okay. The soul was created, the soul was designed only to deal with the natural. Okay. The spirit was designed only to deal with the spiritual. Okay. The soul is designed and this and, and this what I and I'm gonna tell you this, Sharonda. A lot of a lot of believers, because of the fact they don't know this balance of it, mm -hmm. and I'm gonna give you a good example of what, what the Lord is saying, is because of the fact, and I wrote it down too. Hear this wisdom. It goes like, what is your spirit without a soul? Okay. People study the spirit and not the soul. They study what is not seen, mm -hmm. and they forget to study what is seen. Mm -hmm. Wow. Okay. What is seen deals with the natural. The soul only deals with the natural. That means the natural can't even comprehend the things of the spirit. That's right. Literally, it, it really can't. That see, because of the fact when we cry out to God, it's from our spirit. My spirit wasn't designed for you. My spirit was designed for my father, but my soul was designed. Or should I say, it was designed to relate to my father. Mm -hmm. But my soul designed to relate to human. So with that being said, I'm a wife. Uh-huh. I have a husband. Uh-huh. My soul was designed to relate to him. On a on a natural, natural level. level. His soul was designed to relate to me on, on a, a natural, natural level. Okay, so that means that this is what we're dealing with our emotions, our pleasure principle, wow. the different things that um make us all excited but, but can i tell you this though mm -hmm. a, lot, a lot of people a lot of people uh many times get saved and they throw the soul out the window like like in other words they they think you know i'm saved i throw all my common sense out the window mm -hmm. you can't god created our soul for natural pleasure mm -hmm. he created our soul you know to enjoy the things on a natural level mm -hmm. if they could get the revelation that the spirit was not designed for humans mm -hmm. the spirit spirit soul body mm -hmm. that's who we are right right that spirit was designed again for me to relate communicate fellowship talk to my father how you think jesus talked to the father the realm of the spirit his mm -hmm. spirit cried out but how you think he dealt with a human in the natural. on the level of the soul mm -hmm. in the natural you ever heard the word about a many say that we have a perfect god living in an imperfect person do you not know what that means talk to me that means that the father in our spirit he's perfect in us our spirit is perfect because he's in our spirit perfect, mm -hmm. right but the imperfect is that soul mm -hmm. that soul is 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 something that's being saved right it's not perfect i mean it's constantly we constantly have to do work on we it. constantly have to do work on it. but again let's get back to the point it was made for the natural 
Okay. It was made for me to relate to you on a natural level. Jesus could not, people could not relate to Jesus if he was dealing with them on, a, on, on that spiritual level as he talked to the Father. For instance, me and you sitting here, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, and I just go off and talk. What they going to do for you? Nothing, because I can't understand nothing you can, that you said. That's not, because that wasn't made for you. Mm -hmm. That wasn't made for, for human. That was only made for my father on a spiritual level called spiritual language. Okay. But that soul, that soul going to only deal and relate to the natural. Okay. It was created for the natural. It, it's going to, it's created for me to feel your feelings, mm -hmm. to understand what you're going through emotionally. Mm -hmm. uh, it deals with the sight. It deals with the touch. It deals with all these things that deals with the natural. Okay. And people don't understand that that we're not just our spirit. My soul. That's why. Look. See this. This is a shoe. This mm -hmm. don't have nothing to do with the natural. That's that's for the pleasure of my soul mm -hmm. because I like nice shoes. Right. The ple you like nice nice clothes, nice home, nice right. this. That's for the ple that's. That's the natural. That's the natural. Right. That's so, the natural. With this being said, a lot of times I run into ladies, uh, you know, down uh -huh. south, um, religion is everything. You know, we big on religion and I, I stress religion, right? But I need people to understand that just because you are saved does not mean that you no longer have to be intimate with your husband. And as long as you all in agreement, that's pretty much all that matters. For example, I'm going I'm to use this for an example. This morning, I woke up as uh -huh. soon as my eyes opened. My husband prayed over us. And you know what he said? Come on, take care of your husband. That's what you got to do. There's nothing wrong, wrong. with that. Yeah. I need people to understand that we have an obligation Asian. to each other. Right, right. Sexually. Sexually, right, right, right. And your, a lot husband, of your husband, your husband and wife. Right. That's your husband. Can I let me just throw this in? See, it's God first, family second, church third. Okay. Right. Well, how is God first? By your actions or by your heart? In our spirit. God is yeah. first in my heart. Right. But my action is I gotta make sure that my husband is taken care of. Right. Because family is is, is second. That means that if my husband comes and says, Babe, I want to be intimate with you while I'm in prayer. I have to be balanced enough to know, like, okay. You know, God already understand that he's first in my heart, mm -hmm. but my husband has to be taken care of. So that's where the balance come in. And that's where the peace come in. And everybody's on people. Right. It's, you know how people say, oh, you're trying to, you want me to put you before God. No, that's, <laughs> no, 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 no. So in other words, if he's no. coming to you and you in prayer, you're supposed to be like, all right, Lord, I love you, but it's time for me to go take care of the mister right now. That's right. I was going to, it's time for me to take care of the missus right now. <laughs> That's right. Man, how many people make God so unbalanced and so complicated? God is not unbalanced. He's not complicated. It's that if you don't, if you don't have the, if you don't have the proper knowledge mm -hmm. to receive the understanding of uh, the revelation of, of what truth is all about, you you gonna be unbalanced. So ladies, it's okay to snatch your soul. It's it's, <laughs> it's okay to snatch it. Okay. To, to, yeah. That, to, to, that to he, grab God him. created. He he gave him that so that y'all can relate to each other on that type of level. On so that, I'm letting you know that it's okay to take care of him in that manner. And take okay? care of your husband. <laughs> That's right. Don't 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 be trying to be so deep and so. Oh my God. Oh, they try to be but, deep. But, but check this out. Mm -hmm. Oh, I wrote this down too. What? Well, check this out though. Watch this. He. Oh, I love this. He said. That's why so many Christians, wow, believers, mm -hmm. Christians, believer. That's why so many of us and so many of them, should I say, because of fact, when you know better, you do better. Right. That, that's why so many is not only broke, but they're unbalanced. Wow. Let me tell you why. Why? Let me tell you how, how important it is for you to understand that on the realm of the soul. Listen to this wisdom. Okay. We seek the spirit. A lot of us who are saved, mm -hmm. we seek the spiritual things, right? Mm -hmm. The things that's invisible, mm -hmm. the things that's not seen. Mm -hmm. Okay. But those things is not of no worth if they don't come to earth. Right. It has to become tangible. You got to be able to touch it. But, but, check, this out. but, but check this out. Check mm -hmm. this out. When I say broke, that means that God only deal with us on the level where we are, right? Mm -hmm. Okay. 
So on the level of knowing, the Lord don't deal with no with no soul. Let me, let me get this straight. He don't deal with the soul. When God relates to us, he relates to us only on a spiritual level. Mm -hmm. Only the blood of Jesus cleans our spirit and make our spirit perfect. Mm -hmm. All right. But only the word is going to cleanse your soul. That means you got to get that knowledge to understand. But God is only going to deal with us on the knowledge that we know. Mm -hmm. In other words, for instance, I, I, I could be so saved, what have you, but, but my soul need to understand because it relates to the natural. My soul need to understand how money works. Because money is a natural resource. Mm -hmm. Money is, is, is what God graced us in the natural to have a balanced, natural living. And a full life. And a full life. Mm -hmm. uh, you hear what I'm saying? Now, but but if I don't have no knowledge on investment, God can't take me there. Mm -hmm. That means I have to get in. See, we as believers, we think that everything just got to come to us. No, you got to go make things happen. Mm -hmm. You got to validate yourself. You got to bring an approval to yourself. You got to set your own platform. You got to be the, you see what I'm saying? Oh, yeah. So, so, so God deal with us on that level of knowing. So therefore, if I don't know anything about investment, he can't take me there. Right. But I can't wait for you to bring it to me. Mm -hmm. I have to get up, seek that, not, come on, Rhonda. Mm -hmm. seek, for instance, again, that's, that's natural. That's for the soul. Mm -hmm. That, you know what, feed my spirit? Talk to me. Me standing in the presence of the Lord. Mm-hmm. Me in that, you know, me, me studying, you know, the word of the Lord. Oh, that's spiritual. That's spiritual. But what feed my natural of my soul is the things that I know of the natural. Mm -hmm. The things that that's, that's designed and created for the earth. Right. Am I making sense? Oh, yeah. You're making but, a but lot check of this sense. out. Even when it comes down to, to, to food. Okay. A, a lot of people don't eat right. Mm -hmm. and, they, and they don't choose to go study what type. What type of foods to eat so you're a believer, but you're dying early. Mm -hmm. Because the fact, you didn't go to see that they have natural vegetables. They have natural fruit. They have right. natural natural things for the body for you to, to, to partake of to make you more healthy. Mm -hmm. See, I can't, just, I can't just live in the spirit realm. I got to live in the realm of the soul, too, because that deals with the natural. That deals with me taking care of my home. That deals with me taking care of my children. That deals with me taking care of anything that's natural on my job. That's how, that's not spiritual, but the spiritual give me prepared for the natural. Mm -hmm. But the natural is so important because, in fact, this is where I live. Mm -hmm. I live in a natural world. Mm -hmm. I live in a natural world with a spirit of God in me. Mm -hmm. So if I don't know how to balance myself off, I'm going to be unbalanced. Mm -hmm. And by me being unbalanced, then I cannot succeed. Everybody that follow won't succeed. And that's in what? every aspect of your life. Every aspect that's of right. your life. That, 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 that soul deals in only created, only designed for the natural. It designed, it deals with the five sense. It deals mm -hmm. with the taste, the touch, the feeling, and all these different things that I know in the natural. And if, 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 if the soul was so important, then why God says that he, he said, listen, I'll give it earth to man. Mm -hmm. So if God, if, if, if earth was so important, then why would God say he give it to us? Earth deal with the natural stuff. And he wants us to be able to enjoy the natural things. The natural things in life. Mm -hmm. You know, things you like, things you smell, you taste, you touch, you feel, you this. But Yo, you know, everybody understands that all the way until you get to the bedroom. To, uh, and I don't understand that part. It's like you understand this for every aspect of your but life, you don't but your bedroom. <sighs> so my next question is, Jesus, sometimes uh, people it's, of faith deal with reje rejection, rejection in the bedroom, right? Meaning that a lot of times, because I, I posted this the other day and it was from three different men, three different men that basically sent me messages. And the first thing they all said is, I don't want to cheat on my wife. Please help me. Tell me what to do. I am asking for these things to happen. Simple things. Hold that. That's mm -hmm. why God gives you so much of wisdom in the natural level. Mm -hmm. On that natural level. To mm -hmm. help people in their bedroom. Mm -hmm. When you're married with your husband and your wife, mm -hmm. you got the natural wisdom to help to listen because they don't have nothing to do with you speaking in tongues and all this. No. This has everything to do with what's going to make my marriage work in the natural. In the natural. In the, come on. So when you experience some rejection, the, the thing is, I, I, I hear these ladies and a lot of them are saved women and they just feel like it's not that important. 
it sex is not that important. Are and you I just want to understand, you know, because sometimes, and I've seen different pastors preaching on this, you know, basically, if you, um, I don't want to say promiscuous, but I want to say that you're supposed to feel wanted by your spouse, right? And what happens, tell me what happens when your spouse feel like they're not wanted in a marriage. What, what, what type of disaster can that lead to? Number one, rejection is going to point to a divorce mm -hmm. because of the fact of the hurt. Mm -hmm. pain. Nobody want to be rejected. Nobody want to be rejected. Nobody want to be rejected. So if nine out of 10, if that person is feeling rejected, he's going to try to go find her. She's going to try to go find something to fill, a, fill that void. Right. When you got everything your husband and your wife need, you got it. Now, a lot of people make, see, people have different levels of faith and people have different ways how they believe but mm -hmm. you got to allow people to 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 enjoy the level where they are mm -hmm. in their walk with christ you see what i'm saying right you may be on this level i may be on that level but by the balance and the wisdom of god i know how to allow you to be you mm -hmm. because i understand on a human level right that these are certain things for instance okay i, I feel like you want to ask us here what about toys i just feel like as long as you're in agreement as long as you're in agreement that's how I feel. As long as you're in agreement. It's, it's, but it's, the thing is, as long as your husband and you are in agreement, agreement. everybody, everybody else voice or, or opinion should be elementary. Mm -hmm. it, it should not even matter to you mm -hmm. because in fact, their voice and their opinion is not going to keep my marriage together. Mm -hmm. For a simple fact, if your husband say, baby, just put something nice on, put for some me. nice on, put, put, put some smell goods on for me. You know, do, do, you know, in other words, sometimes we forget the same things that it took to get these people. It's the same things we got to do to keep them right. uh, interested. Interested. But you, but you got to, they got to understand. If, if I could get people to understand that you got to feed the soul as well. Mm -hmm. It's important. It's important for me to understand that natural realm. Mm -hmm. To bring a balance to that spiritual realm. It's important. My husband is not spiritual when it comes down to being my husband. He is my husband. Mm -hmm. He may be the spiritual head, but naturally he's my husband. Mm -hmm. So therefore, if he say to me, look, uh, can we get on a pole tonight? That's right. I I'm going to get on that pole. And if, you if, if, if he say, it, it doesn't matter. It, it's whatever bring, what makes my, what makes my marriage healthy may not make, your marriage health. Right. And then when you're trying to get in the mood, you ain't trying to put on no Tamala man, take me to you're the not, king. You're, you're trying to put on some that, listen, Marvin Gaye or okay, whatever. Okay. Okay. <laughs> let, let me just tell you about that. Because of the fact, you know, when I lift up my hands to, that's for God. Mm -hmm. That's everything spiritual that God gave me with him. That's for God, Sharonda. Mm-hmm. But everything that God gave me for the soul, that's for the natural. That's right. So therefore, I'm not putting on in my bedroom, lift up your hands. I'm putting on some Luther Vandross. Right. I'm putting on, because that's dealing with my soul right now. Right. It's dealing with, for instance, you know, when, when, when you have like, you, you when you have like, I, I want to say it the right way, erections. Of, yeah. You know what I'm saying? That's natural. <laughs> yes, ma'am. That's that's natural. That's a, that's a natural release. Right. That ain't got nothing to do with my spirit. That's my soul being relieved. A natural release. Not naturally. Right. Yes. So you, but, but and then you feel better. Your marriage is stronger. Everything. Feel Everything. Oh my God. Five minutes. But I got to say this here before. <laughs> my husband used to leave home every morning years ago. Mm -hmm. Now granted, you know, we've been together 30 some years. It's not Nobody have a perfect marriage, but right. because you work at it, okay, it's like a job. You That's can work right. at it. But but this is what I want to say that he would leave home literally upset. Years ago, he would leave home upset, and 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 be, me being a praying woman, I'm praying, praying, praying in my Bible, right? Mm -hmm. And I tell, I said to God, when well, I said, Lord, I said, why is he leaving to leaving to work? And he's so mad. All I do is pray. He said, That's your problem. That's all you're doing is praying. <laughs> You need to do something. He said, listen, I swore to you. He said, that's your problem. All you're doing is praying. He said, take care of your husband. He wow. said, I'm first in your heart. If your husband tap you and say, come, he said, I don't care if you in the middle of your prayer. Family is second. 
God first in our heart. Mm -hmm. Family second, church third. Take care of your husband. That's right. So when I when I when I listen to to, to, to the Lord, that was a revelation. That was a revelation. Like, but guess what? He didn't leave going to work every morning mad neither. Mm -hmm. He left with peace and yes. a satisfaction. That's right. Because you of, understood what you needed to do for him. Because I knew I had to feed the soul of it. Mm -hmm. If you understand that, no, the soul don't outweigh the spirit. The spirit is always first. Right. But that soul, you got to make sure, like for instance, ain't nothing spiritual about medication. Mm -mm. But why are you going to stop taking it and you die early when you know that this is what's going to keep you alive? Right. <laughs> Common sense. That's dealing with the soul again. Mm -hmm. You got to have a balance with that spirit in there. So I, I, I just hope somebody get a little of this. If y'all have revelation. any questions, we only have a few more minutes. But if you have any questions, concerns, comments, please send them at this time, and I will make sure that they get answered. Give them the um the the. Okay, let me just let you know. This is my spiritual mother. Dr. Bridget Stive. We are at the Ministry of Love. Give them the church address. Twenty nine. South Tomorrow Drive here at Great City of Baton Louisiana. But I'm also put this out there too. Okay. If you know you are married and you know that 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 you want your, your, your sexual life need to go to another level, that's why they're going out getting the freaks. Uh-huh. Because you don't want to <laughs> be freaky. Because you don't want to be freaky. If you freaky with your husband, that's you in come on. So therefore, a PPG was made. Come on. To help somebody on the natural level. Stop trying to put your spirit with your natural. Your God, God do not fellowship, relate, communicate. God don't even talk to the soul. Come on. God only talks to the spirit. Huh. The soul was designed to relate to human on a human level. Anything dealing with the natural. Don't want to go glasses. Anything that deals with the natural. That you don't worry about those, those glasses. It's a balance with all that, Sharonda. Mm -hmm. That's why God gave you that natural wisdom to help these husbands and these wives on that natural level. Right. Me laying hands and praying on you, okay, that's one thing. But if you don't take care of your husband or your wife in that natural, baby, that praying, laying hands on you ain't going to do you no good. No. You got to make sure that you taking care of the soul realm, which deals with the natural, mm -hmm. deals with your feelings, mm -hmm. deal with those emotions, deal with that. Stop. Don't stop being so deep and so spiritual till you're no earthly good. No earthly good. Well, y'all, that is going to conclude Sex Talk with wow. Sharonda today. This was <laughs> awesome. Come on, give me some. <laughs> I, I'm going to go. This was awesome. They need to, but you know, the, the Lord had me bring, the Lord had me with a brand new book release. It's going to be coming out. Mm -hmm. What Make Christmas So Hypocritical. It's going to, it's not to condemn. Right. It's going to bring so much balance to people oh my god in their marriage in their everyday life in their mind in their spirit <laughs> right they gotta know because the fact you know you enjoy certain things in the natural come on you what you mean going to hell that 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 was made for my soul to enjoy <laughs> those things in the natural it's real okay well i have something for your soul what you got <laughs> <laughs> thank you um, all wait 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 I'm gonna give it to you. No, nah, don't you open that. Sure. All right. <laughs> That's for me and my husband. That's for you and your husband. <laughs> y'all be good. Thank I you all for you joining all. us today. Y'all be blessed. You. God is so good. <laughs>